with Arvind Kejriwal in jail while watches political developments in India. Why is the AAP getting so much international attention? How did AAP rise to fame? With important leaders behind the bars, what's next for the AAP Aadmi Party? In the last 12 years, Indians saw the emergence of a new party, a party that kept the issues related to the common man at the heart of its growth. When Indians were fatigued with corruption, price rise, Aam Aadhi Party came forth to voice these issues. But now, 12 years down the line, the party faces a huge challenge. On March 21, AAP's national convener Arvind Kejriwal was arrested by the Enforcement Directorate for his role in the alleged Delhi excise policy scam. This arrest came weeks ahead of the Lok Sabha polls, shattering AAP and India bloc's major campaign programs. With key leaders in jail, the Aam Aadhi Party struggles with its central leadership. But still, the party held multiple protests across the nation, garnering massive public support, alleging political conspiracy by the BJP ahead of the general election. Aap called Kejriwal's arrest illegal, as the ED has not made the evidence against the Delhi CM public. Major opposition parties supported Aap nationwide. The solidarity was evident during AAP's India Bloc rally at Delhi's Ramlila Maidan, where Congress, Samajwadi Party, DMK and others were present. Kejriwal's arrest also drew international attention. But this was not the first time when the West commented on political developments against the opposition parties in India. Kejriwal's arrest garnered international attention, with the West questioning the time of ED's action. The US expressed concerns about the state of democracy and rule of law in India. Some American lawmakers issued statements calling for transparency and due process in Kejriwal's case. We continue to follow these actions closely, including the arrest of Delhi Chief Minister uh, 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 Kejriwal. I'm not going to talk about any private diplomatic conversations, but of course, um, uh, what we have said publicly is what I just said from here, that we encourage fair, transparent, timely legal processes. We don't think anyone should object to that and we'll make the same thing clear privately. International attention to Kejriwal's arrest extended beyond the United States, with media outlets and political figures from various countries commenting on the event. Multiple media outlets have even called Kejriwal India's prime opposition leader. Germany also urged the Indian authorities to ensure a fair and impartial judicial process ahead of the general elections. But how has Ahmadi Party become so important within just 12 years of its inception? Why is the West calling up India's main opposition party? AAP won elections in Delhi three times by winning 90% of seats every time. They also secured a landmark victory in Punjab and gave a tough fight to the BJP in Goa. The Ahmadi Party has undoubtedly emerged as one of India's prime and most famous parties in recent times. Their social media numbers outnumbered the BJP and Congress by a significant margin. The rise of Ahmadi Party triggered a massive debate among the voters in India. In a mere span of 11 years, the Delhi-centric party gained widespread national recognition, even eclipsing the Congress and BJP in some states. However, the Aam Aadhi Party is yet to establish its strong base in the lower house of the parliament. AAP won just one seat in the 2019 Lok Sabha polls. Despite consecutive victories in assembly elections in Delhi, AAP failed to win even a single seat in 2019 Lok Sabha polls in Delhi. In 2024 Lok Sabha polls, AAP is fighting at 13 seats in Punjab, 4 in Delhi, 1 in Gujarat and 1 in Goa. It will be interesting to see where will the AAP finish in these states. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to Mirror Now.